Tired of dealing with your bank's endless fees and confusing terms? Maybe you're just ready for a change. Whatever the reason, you've decided to close your Lunar Bank account. But hold on, there's more to it than just hitting a close account button. Let's dive into the nitty-gritty of shutting down your Lunar account. First off, why on earth would you want to leave Lunar? I mean, it's pretty cool, right? The app, the features, the overall vibe. But let's face it, grass is always greener on the other side, or at least that's what they say. So, if you've made up your mind, let's get this show on the road. The first thing you need to do is check your balance. Yep, you heard me. Make sure that account is squeaky clean. No overdrafts, no pending transactions. Nothing. Because trust me, closing an account with a balance hanging in there is like trying to fit a square peg in a round hole. It's just not going to work. Once your account is looking like a freshly scrubbed kitchen floor, it's time to tackle the standing orders and direct debits. You don't want to be caught off guard with a missed payment, do you? So, take a deep breath and go through that list. Cancel, redirect, or find alternatives. It's a bit of a chore, but it's worth it in the long run. Now, let's talk about the Lunar Card. If you've got one of those fancy metal ones, I'm genuinely jealous. But for now, let's focus on the task at hand. Make sure that card is physically in your possession. Don't worry about cutting it up or anything dramatic. Just keep it safe until you're ready to part ways with Lunar. Alright, the big moment is here. It's time to actually close the account. The easiest way to do this is through the Lunar app. Head over to the Help and Support section, find the Close Account option, and follow the prompts. It might ask you for a reason for leaving. Feel free to be honest or just say something generic like personal reasons. Once you've submitted your request, Luna will confirm it and give you a timeline for the closure. Typically, it takes around 14 business days. So, don't expect your money to vanish into thin air overnight. But wait, there's one more thing. After your account is officially closed, you might receive a final statement. Keep an eye out for that. It's like a final report card for your financial life with Lunar. And that's pretty much it. Closing your Lunar account might seem like a daunting task, but it doesn't have to be a stressful ordeal. Just follow these steps, stay organized, and you'll be waving goodbye to Lunar in no time. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.